hello and welcome to my youtube channel please don't forget to like comment and subscribe and share all right i'm sending messages from mt5 to the telegram is to first create a telegram channel or a telegram group so we are just going to show that we create a telegram channel or group um, let's name this dream tooth then we create yeah so this should be yeah it's a private channel and this is what we have you have to create a telegram bot and then bot father in telegram will help us do that so bot father we start we we'll do a new bot because we are creating a new bot a name for the bot so dream suit dream suit um, i should choose this all right so um, the username of the bot um, should always have a bot at the end so dream suit underscore bot great so we have our bot here now we can just generate our bot token you need a special token for every bot and so we need to generate a special token for our bot so yeah you pay right token and then this is double click on it to select yeah so let's just paste this right here give it a name api key then we send let's pin this all right so let's just go send this to now every chart has an id so we are just going to every telegram channel and every text the same telegram has an id so we are just going to send the tel channel id to telegram so we are able to route messages from any other application right to our telegram channel so let's just go here and go to um, get um, telegram id good so this is it right here this particular um, channel right here this particular application is going to help us get our telegram um, id channel id yeah so as you can see right here it automatically gives you your chat id so let's just copy this and say um, chat id chat id oh, edit. chat id and then we should have this get you this great and we have our api key and then our telegram um chat id generated for us successfully so the next step is to go to metatrader and then code everything from there so yeah let's go to metatrader yeah so one more thing we need to do is we need to attach this um our bot to um, this channel great so we need to add add users and then join bot Right here, you should have a uh, bot. Great, and you should have this bot right here. Yeah, bots can only be added as administrators to group chat. So we do add. We should do that. Yeah. So why uh, we have two subscribers? Let's now move on to our Meta Trader Five. You know, and see what to do. Great. So I have this folder created. So we have um, send TG messages, and then you click on finish. Great. So let's just go ahead and create a simple function that can help us get what we want. Great. So let's create um, every web request returns an integer type. So let's just go ahead and return an integer type. Um, send message great so let's take parameters like the message which is the text um let's send to your chat id you need your chat id and then you need your bot token okay great um sending messages to telegram you need the base url and so the base url let's name it base url base url will be http the string type https and then api the telegram dot org now you need to be you need to add this um, url also in the options tab of the of metatrader 5 we will be doing that in a bit okay so let's look at something web request sending web request we need parameters like the method the url the, the header the timeout Factor data and then the result. Great. So let's define those parameters right here. So we can have headers 
with an empty string because we are not sending any headers in addition to this. So you can have request URL as this uh, great. So you can have string request request headers also as an empty string. Now we can have a character of result data should be a character array. We can also have a character position data also. And then we can have the timeout. Timeout will tell us the amount in um, I think seconds for the request to be sent and received successfully. This is milliseconds actually. Great. So let's just go ahead and see our request URL because this is where we enter or we'll give it the URL to follow to the endpoint. So string format. Let's use string format here. Now we need our base URL right here. Then for sending messages to Telegram, we need to attach a keyword bot to the Telegram I Telegram bot token. So percent s go ahead and the function we use here is called send message. Send message is the message uh, the function we use in sending messages to Telegram. Now sending messages there are certain parameters we need and one is the chat id there you can see the chat id is also a percent s and we also need the text so you can see the text equals also percent what is now right here we specify the um, parameters so base url then the bot token we also need um then we need a chat id and then lastly, we need the text we entered right there. Now, um, this code is the response, and the response will be the web request. The web request of the method. The method of sending is, should be a post method. Now, the URL is request URL right here. Now, let's use the second good. So, you can have headers, you can have timeout. We can have the post data. Here we can have the result data. Then all we can add here is the request headers. Great. Now for our messages, we can say you can use a string result message, result message, and then you can set it as character character array to string array to string and then we can just enter the result data and then it's going to give us the um the return message in in a string format let's just print this let's just print um result message great and then we return the response now response code of 200 in APIs means the request has been sent successfully. Great. So let's just create um, variables. We have the text and then let's just say welcome to um, empty message from MT5. Then we can say string ID equals we copy the chat ID from our telegram group right here good now we also have a token and then the token should also be a string we copy this and then we send it right here good so now let's call this function send message and let's enter our text our id and then our token here Let's alert this so we get the message that we want. Let's compile this to see, and then there are zero errors right here for us. There are zero errors. Let's go to our MetaTrader and see what we have. Great. Um, great. So we have send TG messages. Let's click on this. And then it says 200. Now let's go to our Telegram group see what happens here message from telegram right there yeah so 
I was saying we we have to add our request URL right here. So right here we should have um, um where is this great so expert advisors we should have added this if you hadn't added this it wasn't going to work so the easiest way to let's just delete this and then run our expert advisor and we get negative one negative one to let us mean a message we don't have that url as part of the urls that are allowed for an expert advisor to send um, requests from the trader to other applications so all you have to do is go to tools copy the request URL, go to tools add new url and then we add telegram the telegram url right here then we click on ok let's try and send messages let's send another message here say hello world hello from 95 <coughs> compile this click on send tg messages and great we have our error message of 200 and then the message right here tells us that the message has been sent to telegram successfully in our next set of videos we will be doing sending images to telegram we'll be doing sending documents pdfs sending other documents like sending templates right from telegram we'll be looking at sending polls sending um, votes and others to telegram so stay tuned and don't forget to subscribe like and share my videos thank you